so this is part three due to storage it's going to be a little chopped up for you but that's okay as long as you get the message now continuing on this is the judgment card okay so again looking beyond illusion okay with the eye for aries sun moon rising and venus you've probably been feeling um you know so much emotion so much like so many emotions so many yeah, you've probably been in your emotions a lot. And, you know, since we're a fire sign, usually water puts out the fire. And we're like, what? So it could have been like, you know, you haven't been feeling as passionate. Um, Aries, you are a passionate sign. So before I continue on with that, um, for some, you, it's a possibility that, with the Taurus being, the Taurus energy being in there and Taurus being a sign that craves stability, there's probably been like a plumage, if I said that right, in um, your stability, you know, finances probably, okay? And you're going to receive um, a little bit of love with that situation to change the direction of that situation, okay? So that's where the page of cups upright comes into play okay you're going to receive some form of recognition and the eye stands out from me right here okay god recognizes what you went through but again um you know it's it's an illusion okay to prepare you for something better okay propel prepare you for this change aries okay now with the nine of pentacles, it's a possibility since it's downward, okay? Um, you know, your partner could feel like you're not fully um, giving, okay? Giving as much or putting as much effort in or maybe you're shutting your partner out. Um, also, what this represents is God saying, hey, okay, yeah, you, you're you going to receive something temporarily. Tempor uh, something that's temporary okay but what is it that you can do to make it lasting okay what kind of effort can you put forth to make it last okay so when you get this whatever that is for you aries you're going to rise above and start putting in more effort okay to figure out how you can make something temporary last so that it can grow okay now it's going to be well deserved, okay, with the devil card being upright, okay? Again, you're going to be in the presence of an angel, okay? This is a teachable moment, okay? You're going to receive something. Notice right here, let's see, notice right here, I don't know if I can make that not blurry, there we go. You see that? It's a place right there, see? You're going to receive something. It could even be like a plan, okay? A plan that is given to you, okay? See that? To help you out, okay? See how this person's holding out the cup of love, okay? Some form of emotion. For some, you possibly have been having some kind of dreams, possibly. You need to write it down, what you've been dreaming about, okay? Because it means something. I had looked into something the other day, and it talked about, like, um, getting a glass of water and filling it up, right? And then also having a dream journal and a pen and write and having it next to you. So, um, the lower, the as the water evaporates in the glass, because it's supposed to evaporate, right? And disappear. So as it disappears, that'll be the end of the dream. But every night you write down what you dream about, okay? And before you go to sleep, write down on that paper, the dream journal, or just a you know, plain piece of paper, what it is that you're asking. So when you go into your dream, you'll be ready to write it down, okay? So you'll be able to recognize it. So that's something else that that reminded me of right there, okay? You're in your power, okay? You are coming into your power now. Again, last month, you probably felt like emotional, okay? You went through a tower moment, okay? It was some transfer transformation going on with you, okay? But it's now over, Aries, intuitively, okay? Um, again, I feel like, you know, you had a lot of angels, like, working 
um, with you, okay? And still, I feel like they still are, okay? With your situation, okay? But it's starting to, it's going to start to, you know, cease, okay? So with this card, if you had a question, it's up to you. If you had a question this month, okay? You're being told to do positive affirmations, to change some things. You love yourself, right? You are worthy, healthy, happy, things of that nature, okay? And again, that I, okay? To put it in your heart so that your heart recognizes it, okay? And know that you are good enough, okay? You could have Virgo in your chart. Know a Virgo. Somebody you talk to could be a Virgo. Um, they could have Virgo in their chart. But, um... You know, if not, this just talks about Virgo energy around, okay, around you to where maybe you felt like you've been given so much because Virgos give so much of themselves. They're usually nurses, okay? And Aries don't get enough credit for this, but Aries are, they are similar in the nursing type way, okay? They give a lot of themselves, okay, to people they are passionate about. All right, and last, healing, healed, healer. Okay, so healing energy surrounds you in this situation. So you are going to heal from this, okay? And again, that makes sense to why Virgo energy is in play. So we're going to end this with a positive affirmation. Aries, know that no matter what you went through last month, okay, or whatever you go through at all, know that you are good enough. Thanks for tuning in to Toy Tarot. Bye, Aries.